Hey guys, before I start this video, I need to let you know this is a paid promotion in partnership with Bandai Namco Entertainment. Hi guys, it's Shannon from Yanomise and today it's all about Nico's amazing Nissan GTR. Now we're shooting something really, really cool today. So I've got Lee from Bandai Namco Entertainment. Now you might have heard of Namco before, so I'm gonna let Lee tell you a little bit about the company and what we're gonna to do to this car. Super excited to be here today, especially with this beast of a motor. Bandai Namco Entertainment, very famous back in 1980 for creating Pac-Man, alongside many other hit titles, and we've got some exciting stuff coming up. So Lee wanted something a little bit crazy. I could have given him a Lambo, a Ferrari, a Porsche, a Bentley, and he was like, Yanni, I want it a bit more raced up. And I was like, okay, but why do you want such a car that's souped up? It's obviously got to be for something really special. Tell them at home what we're doing. The game is Fast and Furious, fans dream. You know, this is the closest that you'll ever get to the kind of movie franchise, Fast and Furious Crossroads. It's coming out on PC, PS4, Xbox One on the 7th of August, and we're super excited about it. I thought, you know, who better to speak to than you if you had the opportunity to create your own bespoke rap on this beast of a car, what would you do? The minute you hear Fast and Furious and you hear a game, I'm in. I like to be involved. It was easy for me to pick a Ferrari or choose one of the Lambos, but I think that car does it a bit more justice for the game. This is, I would say, as close as possible. It's got a massive body kit. It's on air ride. It's got an IP sports exhaust that blows out flames like that and it pops and bangs. Nico's gonna drive this car around after we've finished filming and after we've done what we're doing. Um, I won't reveal it right now. So me and Nico spoke and we've come up with an idea. Lee actually doesn't know, but he knows it's gonna be crazy and out there. So continue watching and see what color we wrap it, what design we're gonna to do to the car and have a listen to the exhaust. Right, so the valves are closed at the moment. So I'm gonna open up the valves. It's like a sensor. Maybe we can put this in the game. You never know. You never you know. know. Fast and Furious Crossroads. I can't wait. Yeah, I've been waiting for so long to get it wrapped, but now it's gonna happen now. <laughs> That's gonna blow up the internet links. All over the internet. Let's see if there is, let's see. So as you know, we're working on Nico's GTR Liberty Walk. Mad body kit, mad car, quick, brilliant exhaust. And as you well know that these kits are put on not to be taken off. But guess what? We're about to take it off, see how it comes apart, and then we'll keep you posted. But hopefully everything goes well. So stay tuned and let's go. Tell me, tell me, tell me what you see inside. Team of Yanomai's are used to stripping down cars, however, this is a liberty walk, so the arches are no joke. Nico's there, so that's Nico's car. Nico's like overlooking this to make sure Pav does a good job, which he always does, but this is not gonna be an easy car to wrap. And as it's Nico's personal car, it needs to be even better. Plus, Fast and Furious Crossroads, I'm excited for this. This is gonna be crazy. So the car is stripped now, as you can see, there's no door in here. Now we're gonna rebuild the color. The color I've chosen of this car is... Oh, it's the wrong one. Chrome orange. As you can see, it's quite bright. I've chosen the chrome orange because it's a JDM color. It's a proper Japanese color like when you go to Japan they love orange, like bright colors like green, yellows. And yeah, I think this one's gonna be something different. Actually I got two choices, chrome orange or pink chrome. Not a lot of GTR got the chrome orange, so that's why I chose this one. Every single Japanese car they love like the loud color, so I think I hope I got the right color of this car, but 
Let's see what's gonna happen. The like uh, van is looking great. As you can see, we just rubbed the arches in here. The arch is quite big, so you can see the difference. Oh, it's looking good. I love it. I'm so excited. I wish that we can finish this one quick, but this one's hard. We have to take our time because the owner is a bit fussy. So, let's see. We're gonna mix it up with the satin black elements as well. Like on the bonnet, we're gonna do the middle bit in satin black. All the body can see satin black, so I hope it will work. We're gonna do the mirrors as well in satin black. Mix and match. Let's see what's gonna happen. So, chrome orange is the color. You can see bonnet is satin black, the roof's gone satin black. We're trying to break it up a little bit. Hold on a minute. Nico just wants to just make as much noise as possible. I've got to let him get away, but it's his car to be fair. Are you ready, Nico? You ready now, yeah? Any more noise? Okay, so we're going to run that again. So the boys have decided to do the bonnet in satin black and the roof, and I believe the spoiler is also going satin black. This is going to be very, very bright. We are under immense pressure to get this finished uh, for Fast and Furious Crossroads. That is the game that we are wrapping this for as such. We've still got to put the doors on. They're wrapping one door now. We've got to get the car back on the floor. And then once it's on the floor, we've got to put all the livery over it. So that's all the design going down both sides of the car. It's really, really cool. And I've actually seen some of the things on the game. You can actually drive as Dom, Letty, or even Roman. And they are voiced over by the original character. They want to play with fire? And let's turn up the heat. You also get a chance to drive all the iconic cars, new cars, and some classics as well. You can form a crew with all your friends. Do missions, pursuits, takedown, heists, all while driving some real cool cars. So when this game comes out, I'll be definitely getting it for my boys. But is it for my boys, or is it really for me? I know I'm going to be playing it. I know my staff are going to be playing it as well. We might form a crew ourselves. We could do like the Yanomai's crew, yeah? Get together, get a few cars, and um, see who's the best. So hey guys, the car's now fully wrapped. We're in quite a big rush. Pav and Chris over there are now fitting up the car. I've started cutting the stickers. They're gonna start going on slowly. I'm gonna have to follow Pav and Chris around the car as they fit it up to put the stickers on. We have quite a tight deadline on this one today. Nico's already stuck the first sticker on. And yeah, let's get cracking. All right, so me and Pav are about to fit the kit on this. Uh, as you can see, it all has to go together in one piece. So it take three of us to support it, put it on the car. Not only that, we've got a rubber bead that runs around the body kit that we have to make sure that it sits correctly and, um, and actually looks like something at the end of it. Let's get on. So the car is complete and it is behind the shutter. I'm gonna bang the shutter and do a reveal. Lee from Namco, as you guys have met him already. And I've got Andy, who's the lead director on the actual game, Fast and Furious Crossroads. Are you excited? Very excited. Have you got any idea what it's gonna look like when it comes out? I can't even imagine. The Fast and Furious has had so many different cars in the franchise, in the movies. And we've gone from like 2000 where like wraps and liveries were so crazy to nowadays where they're a bit more subtle i don't know what you've gone for so let's let's find out lee knows the color of the car andy do you know no what color do you think it might be uh knowing you it could be anything from chrome green to rose gold i have no idea bright um pink. bright pink let's go <laughs> it's okay <laughs> not bad not bad right so i've got the team ready inside you guys ready? You excited? Super excited. Absolutely. Well, most of the team have come out to see it as well. Let's bang the shutter. Oh. That is hooks. 
that is sick. Wait for the sun to hit it. Nice. Oh my god, it's amazing. Ah, uh, wicked. Look at that. Tribal. Yanni, that is awesome. What a great job. Really cool. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have that guessed. That is stunning. Look at the sun on it as That's well. That's really cool. That's the really sun cool. come out perfect timing. I knew it would be metallic. Chrome, <laughs> it's at least. Chrome. Yeah, you said, when you said chrome, I was like, I'm impressed. <laughs> have a look. I think we need to rev it up as well. Nico, rev it. Such an awesome colour. It's awesome. What colour was it originally? Grey, it's like a Nardo grey. So Nico owns this car. And when we were thinking of what car to use, obviously I can get a Lambo, I can get a Ferrari, and it was like, Fast and Furious, it's the game. It had to be something out there, something leery. First movie was all about US muscle versus imports, so an import car like this. So we had the perfect car. So I said to him, do you mind if we use your car? He's like, no problem. Um, he's got his car wrapped for free as such. <laughs> yeah, I bet, I bet you jumped to the chance. He gets it for anyway, but. Who come up with the idea for the wrap and the color? Is it collaborative? So I chose the chrome orange because it's a Japanese color as well. So how we stand out, chrome orange, and mix it up with the satin black. Then I asked Bert and Ioni if we can came up with a tribal design on the side. It's really nice. nice. I think it works. In the sun, it pops. It's really going to stand out. <laughs> no, it's brilliant. Yeah, really, really awesome. cool. You've done really a brilliant job. Yeah, and tasteful amazing. as well. Yeah. Like, as I said, like the franchises came out in the 2000s. So that was when it was all dragons down the side and huge racing stripes and things like that. And this is kind of a, a mix of both. Really tastefully done, but then almost with a bit of Homage to the original. Exactly, because it's chrome. When the sun hits it, it's just unbelievable. Yeah. And in the shade, it's great. At night, it's great. Yeah. Under the sun, it's amazing. It pops. It pops. And obviously, we're taking this somewhere um, next week. Yeah. Something's going on, but there'll be more details on that on the next video. Fast and Furious Crossroads is coming out 7th of August. But for us to like celebrate the launch of the game, I'm taking this car somewhere. And there's going to be another 100 plus cars there as well. More will be revealed on the next video it's from myself lee and andy and obviously the nissan gtr nico's car fast and furious crossroads stay tuned for more i'll see you on the next video take care see you later